my channel my name is Immy so today's video is actually gonna be a haul video and this is not my usual kind of haul I'm trying to stop doing those I've said this in my past few haul videos that I really shouldn't be doing them I'm the reason we have fast fashion but I am doing a sustainable haul so this is either things that I have thrifted or from a company that I am currently working with this is not like sponsored or a promo or anything they haven't asked me to do this this is just because YouTube is probably my main platform and what I do with them is on Instagram but I wanted to talk about them because I genuinely feel really passionate about them as a company. I, I also got a new ladder. This is um, a bamboo ladder that I got from a company called SKURM or RUM or something like that and I think it's really cute. I kind of think I might do the bottom of it white but I wanted to buy it natural so I could decide because I've seen all the like edgy ones on Pinterest have white on the bottom but I'm not sure yet. We'll see. It was only like 20 quid as well really good fantastic don't know why I'm telling you about it but it's just really cute and I get excited about home stuff so there we go I'm just gonna get into what I got today so firstly I'm gonna show you what I got from charity shops I actually wasn't planning on buying anything when I did this I was just gonna talk about the company but I happened to be going go back home to Shrewsbury well back to my old home last week for Joe's birthday and we had a little look around and I just got some really cool pieces so the first one is just a top but it is a kind of like polo shirt, you know the ones that are kind of like Brandy Melville, the rugby style, but they're like floral and ditzy and they've got cute collars and stuff. Well, I got one of those for two pounds. This is what it looks like. It's got this little neck and buttons that you can do up. It is long sleeved, that doesn't work the right, but it is long sleeved. And it is like a full length one, but I am thinking about cropping it. It's from a brand country collection and it's so small, so I don't really know what that is. But it's really cute, it's got these little like indigo flowers and navy blue flowers all over it. I think it's really adorable. It just reminded me of like brandy stuff and I was thinking this with some cute jeans, it's just real nice. So yeah, I think I might crop it though because I don't. Th it's a bit too fitting to like, it would look weird tucked in. I think I just got my lipstick on it as well. I know I'm blind, but I think I'm going insane too. But yeah, cool. That was church shop, two pounds, two pounds. <laughs> Can't count. The next item that I'm going to talk about is actually probably my favorite thing in this entire haul because it is such a gem. I am so happy with this find and I managed to get a pair of Levi's jeans. If you follow me on Instagram, I did put these on my story because I was so darn excited about them. They were only £5.75 for a pair of Levi's jeans, in my size. Um, they don't have the tag on the back there, which is annoying, but they do have the tag on the butt. And I feel like, I don't know what size they are, because let me have a look at the labels. Let's figure this out, shall we? Okay, it looks like there once was a label in here that said a name, but now it is this black thing which is peeling off and has no writing on it. So I actually don't know what size they are, but they just happen to be in like the small section of like the women's jeans. And I just picked them up, but they are bloody flares. And <laughs> some people then might be like, ew. But I have wanted flares since I watched like the first Mamma Mia movie. And then when I watched the second Mamma Mia movie and I saw Lily in them, I was just like, I'd have to get some flares. And obviously me being me, I don't really buy any jeans other than Levi's because, um, I just like to buy high quality things that I know are going to last a long time and also we're in Liverpool we have a league guys where if anything breaks you can go in and get it repaired in the shop for free so it's kind of fantastic again the whole sustainable ethical thing coming around I don't feel like I need to replace them that often so now that I have a pair of these I'll probably wear them until I threadbare they are this kind of stripy denim wash like it is such a 2000s kind of style but I really love them. I love that they're flared. This makes me so happy. And um, yeah, that was like the most ultimate gem find in the world. I couldn't be more pleased because I've been after flares for such a long time. I know that Topshop had some and ASOS had some, but I refused to buy jeans that weren't Levi's. And the Levi's ones are obviously, 
think my SOG is like 80 pounds and um, I don't buy them that often. So for a pair of flares I might not wear like every day like I do with my straight leg ones, it's kind of not worth the same amount to me. But oh my God, less than six pounds. I'm so chuffed. Oh, I have fluff on my face somewhere. Now I'm going to be moving on to the company that I've been waiting to talk about and the brand is Nobody's Child and I, um, this is, came with their parcel, it's this little cute thing and it is, I think they don't do it to everyone, they do it like once a quarter or once a new season or something and it says, care about the ultimate cost of fashion, not just the price tag, this could be the start of a beautifully dressed friendship, we're building a collection, a col we're building a collection of your con- Conscience will thank you for. Okay, it made sense when I continue reading it. Make better decisions, shop with a conscience. Nobody child, nobody's child.com. And this is for their like spring collection. I actually reached out to them. I wouldn't normally do that because I don't feel like I have a large platform or anything, but I'd seen they had a student ambassador thing and I was really loving their clothing items. They were really gorgeous. I was gonna buy some anyway. I just kind of dropped the message and they were really lovely and they got in touch with me and they have let me be part of their student ambassador program so I have a discount code for everything I will link all the items I show you down below they're already extremely reasonably well priced like I was really shocked and I get 20% off as well for you guys so that makes me so happy my point is if I can help you help support another conscious sustainable brand then that's just a win-win for me instead of promoting these fast fashion companies i know the h&m is getting a lot better but this company they have small collections they don't have loads of clothing like you do on a normal huge site they are also stuck to asos but obviously my discount code won't work on asos and um they're just great i love their social medias they have really cute like oh i love it on this um, paper, they also have on the back about upcycling. They donate leftover materials to fashion colleges and help inspired designers, which is also great because I'm a fashion student, so that's really great that they're promoting that. We rarely print, but we always recycle, so all their paper is recycled that they print on. They also have two hashtags that kind of come along with their brand. If you follow them on Instagram or any other social media, you'll see this a lot, and it's hashtag nobody cares, which I kind of love because like it's just funny. And then the other hashtag is we are nobodies. So Nobody's Child is just a great brand. They have a really great aesthetic, especially if you like kind of similar style to me. So now that I have dragged on about the environment and sustainability and being all ranty at you, you can now see some cute clothes. And I'm going to start with the first two pieces that I got because I actually got these in two loads because there was my first initial two pieces and then I got another three from the newest spring collection. So the first piece that I got, I've actually put a picture of this up on my Instagram already. And it is this blazer. Um, it's really classic and nice. I've wanted one of these for quite a while now, but I didn't really have the means to just buy one because it wasn't, that's the problem with blazers in the UK is that unless you're wearing them under something, it hasn't been warm enough to wear them by itself. But yesterday or the day before, it was the best weather for it and I love it. So this has a kind of brown, black and a blue check in it. There is obviously a neutral toned background and it has a blue check. It has these big black buttons on it and even if you didn't like the buttons you could always change them out and then keep them because again I feel like that's a great thing about companies like this because they stand for upcycling if you did want to do something like that and maybe have like a gold detail or a coloured button it could look really cool um it is pretty long line I obviously will try it on for you and then it has two pockets and it's a very light fabric so it is perfect for layering I love blades because you can dress them up or down so really classic piece was really excited to receive this and finally have a blazer like this so thumbs up in my book so that blazer was only 30 pounds to start with and obviously with my 20 percent discount code which is nc times imi 20 so it's nc for nobody's child and then times capital x imi 20 and you'll get 20 percent off that is all in uppercase and that would make the blazer math 24 pounds in the set 24 pounds like that is a little wild and it is really high quality and you're like again you're buying clothing with a message i think that's probably the most important thing to me the next item that i picked up is this hound's tooth pillow dress it has this little belt on it this is just screamed very like 60s 70s to me i can imagine this like a little 
scroll neck and some go-go boots, some white go-go boots. Oh my God, that'd be so cute. I don't have any of those, but if I did, that's what I wear it with. And this was only, I think it was, let me have a look, let me double check. So this was only 26 pounds. And again, 20% off, don't forget. They also have some really similar ones like this in different colors. They also have a new spring one, which is really cute, but I'm not gonna spoil it yet because I have something similar to that maybe. This next item is actually what you can get in dress form that is similar to the houndstooth one that I just showed you. And it is this blue gingham play suit. Now this is very bold, but I saw it in their spring campaign and I kind of just fell in love. It's a zip in a love, in love. I know what I mean. It has that very similar style to the pinafore. It has thin belts around the center, which I really like because I do like to like tighten my waist in to make me look like I have some kind of silhouette. <laughs> I'm not a 12 year old boy. Um, <laughs> but yeah, and it is kind of clotty as well. It's a straight leg. It's really nice. It is a very light material and I cannot wait for it to get really warm so I can wear this. I think it is so freaking adorable. I love it. I love that and that was also 30 pounds. I'm actually now onto my last two items and like I said this isn't my usual haul because there's not tons of stuff. I only think I have seven items today but I think that's good. I'm cutting down. I'm getting stuff that I really really love and um, I'm doing a lot of this because I'm really excited about it. This is actually something I saw on ASOS first and I was so excited when I saw it come onto their website. I just had to get it straight away. I also saw this on Kate, is it Kate Levy on Instagram? I think that's her name. Kate Levy, yeah, that makes sense. Um, she had this and she had like done the link and I swiped up, I saw it was nobody's child and was obviously over the moon. And um, yeah, I was so excited when I came to their website. And it is this dress. It is kind of, has these flutter sleeves, what are they called? Fluty, ruffle, soft sleeves. Um, and a v-neck and it is I can't remember if it's maxi or midi but you'll see when I try it on and it buttons pretty much all the way down it has a v-neck and it buttons to about like a foot off the ground because it has this open bit at the bottom and it's just so cute it has these orange and purple and green flowers not that colors that I would normally think would go together but on this dress the pop of like orange actually works really well because I'm not really an orange and purple person. However, I think it just contrasts really nicely and it isn't so soft and delicate. It's a bit more modern and a little, I love it. I just really, really like this dress. So this dress is actually 32 pounds, but that's the most expensive item I picked up and it's only 32 pounds, which is crazy. And now onto my last and final item. That doesn't make sense. They mean the same things. Okay, on to my last item. Um, this I actually sent to Joe when I saw it come up on the website because it has the same name as me. It is called the Imogen Dress and I don't know, I really like it when things with my name because I was that kid who couldn't really find like mugs and stuff with my name on. So it got me really excited. This is a mini dress and again it has these, I swear, it, oh no it doesn't. This is more tapered arms. This isn't the fluty arms. This is more tapered arms but it's a v-neck. It is mini and it has this side panel which has this kind of like it's with like corset detail and I feel like you could tighten it here if you didn't want to like wear a belt because I don't feel like a belt would go with that detailing. But this is like a little skatery A-line dress and it has this ruching around the boob area. Not that I um, have any boobs but maybe it'll make me look like I do. And this is probably my favourite item. I just love this. It kind of reminds me of like my cherry aesthetic emote, that, this reminds me of that, like that whole cherry aesthetic, Lolita, Lana Del Rey look. And oh my god, I love it, I think it's so cute. So this is called the Pink Imogen Heart Print Mini Dress and it is £28. Again, really fantastic pricing, 100% worth it. Feels so soft, I cannot wait until it's warm and I can just wear this. Oh, it is so like comfy it feels like pjs that is it for today's video that is everything that i got i hope you enjoyed it and i hope you liked looking at my purchases i will link everything down below and do not forget my code i know i've plugged it enough i'll put it down below put it on the screen and i'll say it one more time for you it is nc times me 20 or ncx me 20 but you get that right maybe i've been saying it wrong this entire time 
Sorry, I'm gonna stop now. I'm gonna go follow me on my Instagram. Um, it is Immy underscore Lily. That's where I post a lot about baby's child and what I buy and other stuff like that. Um, because I feel very passionate about these things, as you can probably tell. But that is it. I'm gonna go now. I love you all so much, and I will see you next time.